Hey, it's Baz here, back with another YouTube video, and I just want to talk about the PlayStation 5 Teardown. Let's get to it. So, PlayStation had just I brought out a video today with the teardown of the PlayStation 5. So, I just want to have a wee quick talk about some of the rumors and it's been a very interesting breakdown as to, you know, the layout, you know, the layout of the all the components and the fan and so on and so forth. Um, I probably need to watch a few more times, but um, one of the things that I just want to take from this, I'm going to focus on at the moment, the most at this time, is the SSD because there's been a lot of rumors and speculation as to what what way it was going to be. Because I heard one of the rumors I heard was the potential is the only way there's going to be like an expansion port for the SSD or the M.2 as you want to call it was that you had to take out the existing one and replace it so I was watching through the teardown I've took a few screenshots I'm just going to maybe have them playing just as I'm talking here and they had so during the teardown I was showing so they had to take off obviously the bottom part and the back the two panels and so that left like a wee grey metal plate and they lifted that off and below that then obviously there is the socket for the M.2 and obviously the screw port so you know that exactly what and where it's going to go on to so as, as I was watching then I was like right so there's no definitely none there and so that's to me the expansion port so I just kept on watching just to see and I took a couple of wee more stumps as well and I wanted to see exactly then that to make sure that the actual SSDs were built into it, you know. So as I'm watching through here, watching through the video, I took a wee new stop it, so I'm gonna add them into the video when I edit it. And a wee picture to show that the SSD is actually built into the actual motherboard or sock as they call it I think. And so you do have that eight hundred and twenty five gigs SSD obviously you don't get the full thing. The rumor does that you get six hundred and sixty four but plus then obviously there's the expansion for the M dot two slot. Um I had been talking to somebody earlier on the day and I wasn't sure, I haven't seen if this was confirmed or not, but they had said, now I just need to check this out, this is just speculation, that the Samsung 980 Pro was pretty much confirmed to be running this because they said they could put it into it. Now I haven't seen this from the video, but I might have an hour we look at that and if I see any articles I'll put it in the video description below. Um, but yeah, so we're going to have your main SSD that's built in, plus when we've got a full drive that's an expansion. But these drives are not going to come cheap, obviously, because you're talking like a 980 Pro that's com if nearly, if it's almost confirmed, or maybe it's confirmed, I'm not sure about it at the time of recording, that they're going to be $230 plus in America, plus whatever VAT is. In America, whatever, it's 5 or 10%. And I think it depends on what state you're in. So you're, you know... It's not the cheapest drives you're putting in, but it's the you know people need to understand it's the spec of these drives and the speeds that are running that you can buy you can buy cheaper dot m dot twos, but they won't be compatible because they're not running at the speed that PlayStation needs them to run at you know for the games from for their system and the architecture they're designed. But yeah, so I just, just going to wrap it up there. It's just might be quick video what I do on this. I might do another one, maybe a full breakdown on. But I just wanted to focus on the SSD and the speculation rumor. So it has going by this video, it has been confirmed that there's going to be an extra expansion plot, exp an extra expansion slot for the M.2. But you know, it has been interesting. I might do it, you know, a video full breakdown. See, so maybe have a wee look over it and my thoughts and on it as well. But it was interesting what I've seen, you know. But sometimes I like to just digest it and go through it a couple of times and you know think about it and me get my own thoughts built up but anyway you know i'm just going to leave it there but this this where we're at now we've got confirmed that there is an expansion slot for the playstation 5 and um, but they're not going to be cheap but we'll just have to wait and see maybe over time they'll bring them down in price but here i'll leave it there so if you like this video hit that like button and subscribe and if you want to be notified of future videos hit that bell notification and i'll see you in the next video see you soon bye